So footage is back from I've been, yeah. Well, so I've backstage been, at All In, um, FTR are backstage. They go up to the Bucks, and the Bullet Club Gold interrupted. Now, okay. First off, the Bucks, <laughs> the, the 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 Bucks are fucking. They're just not good actors. Get them a manager. At let all, them do dude. flips. They're just Army. not good fucking actors. They're not good talkers. They're Bad not vibe. good. They're not believable. They're trying too hard. It's something like in the indies, they were way better. And then now that they like are, they're like trying to do WWE or so. I just don't know. It's really bad. FTR. Okay. Whatever. But then they go in there, show more respect after they just showed respect in the ring. But now you're going to go show more respect. And then BCG are going to walk in and go, yeah, we won. Oh, Hey, I know how about us versus you guys. But, like, don't you have a vendetta with the elite? Why don't you go, yeah, now, Bucks, you guys are... Why the fuck do you want FTR involved in this? Why would FTR agree to do this? Why would they go backstage to blow the Bucks more after they already showed each other respect out there? What does Bullet Club Gold gain by not just isolating the Bucks and jumping them like they did Kenny? So they just jump Kenny, but they don't just roll the Bucks, and then FTR runs back and <laughs> saves them or something? Oh, but they did that on Dynamite. Okay, but like, do like, so why did they do that? It's just none of this shit makes sense. It's so dumb. And now we have FTR and the Bucks are going to team up in eight mans. I predicted this on the show a couple weeks back. I said, we're eventually going to get FTR and the Bucks teaming up in passing. And then we didn't even touch on it. I just, I, but I said it. Now, do I love BCG? Yes. But it's almost like the Bucks are trying to suck off of the bullet club and FTR's heat that they have, like, cause they're over as fuck with everyone and the bucks aren't over at all. And Brian last said something on the Jim Cornette experience. That was very riveting. He said, Shout out to Brian Lass. He, he's like, listen, everyone's seen all the bucks moves. Right. right. And then, and then after, yeah, yeah. and then now they're bosses and shit. So we know they're in charge of shit, but then after we see them, like we see all the drama and all that stuff, it boils down to, okay, what can you guys do now that you're on national television and you're not just on my Twitter feed or when I throw on a P a pay-per-view or a PLE now that you're like actually featured weekly week to week, what do you guys have to offer that other people don't? And that is, they have yeah. no character. They don't have, there's no good stories. The gimmicks like kind of like, what's the gimmick? You're just smarmy assholes, you know, like, Hey, you know, people do that better than you, you know? So, sorry, Hairline, what were you going to say to that? What were you going to say to that? Yeah, I, yeah. yeah. I was just saying, I, I love that Brian basically said what you said there. Fuck it. Yeah. There's no sizzle anymore, you know? Yeah, like, what is there to offer beyond, like, okay, I've seen all your cool flips. I've seen the Meltzer, and I still love them. But, like, you got to fucking nope. pick and choose. Yeah. Anyways, though, I'm going on and on just dissecting. But this dynamite needs to be dissected because this is exactly what's wrong with this company, man. Anyways, Bullet Club Gold are going to fight FTR and Bucks in an eight, man. <laughs> I'm predicting it now, and I've been right about all this the whole time. We're going to get one of the Bullet... We're going to get, like, Jay and Juice versus Young Bucks versus FTR in, like, a three-way ladder match. The Bucks are going to get the belts, and then we're going to see the Elite and whatever break off and do their thing for a bit. Because I do believe the Bucks do want those tag titles back. That's why they went to the division. But they they did the right thing by giving FTR the trilogy. But they're gonna to keep FTR strong. They're gonna figure out a way to get the belts off them without pinning them. So I just see, I just foresee, yeah, like a a, a three way ladder A-ride. match. Yeah, 